And I'm going to go over 5, 7, 9, 11, 13. If you want to move ahead, go ahead. But here's the deal. Actually, don't move ahead. Stay with me. Because when you come up and ask questions 6 through 18, I'm going to say, use what you know from the questions that we did. And then everyone will have the right answer. So don't work ahead, Josh. Tell them. No. Okay. Number six states, what number is 8% of 370? 8% of 370. So is this number going to be bigger than 370 or smaller than 370? Okay, I didn't even go. Okay, what number is 35% of 630? So is 630 going to go up or down? Down. Think about this. If I say, if really, really think about this, it's going to be gross. If I say, John, give me 35% of your body. Are you giving me your whole body? No, you're giving me like your leg. You're not giving me the whole thing, right? So, give me 35% of your hair. No. <laughs> <laughs> Same. Same. Give me 35% of your teeth. That sounds painful. Right, but am I, are you, am I giving all your teeth? No. No, I'm taking 35% of your teeth. So here's what you do. You take 35% and you multiply by 630. That keyword of, if you want to think about it, it says of, we're going to multiply. So this number is going down. 35% of 630 is probably 200. 220.5. Okay, 220.5. Nice. We're on number. That was number one, five actually. That was number five. So now we're on number seven. And again, watch this. What number is 160% of 65? Now, before you guys think this is a smaller or bigger number, 160% of 65, what do you think? It's going to be more. And look, if I fill up my water bottle 50%, how much of my water bottle is filled up? If I fill it up 100%, how much? If I fill it up 160%, it overflows. So my number from 65 has to go up. So you're going to take your 160% and you're gonna multiply it by 65, and you're gonna get 112? 104. 104. Yes. 